on fire. The blaze broke out just after 9 a.m. in the kitchen and quickly spread to the rest of the Lake Misaki mobile home. When fire departments came to put the fire out, they found that it was caused by a microwave. Gentlemen states, um, put a cup of coffee in the microwave, did a couple errands, came back, kitchen wall was on fire. I cooked me, warmed me up a cup of coffee, got the coffee out, went to the bedroom to get my heart pills and my pain pills and turned back around the wall's on fire with the microwave just right there, it's burning. All Mullins could do was sit and watch with his girlfriend Sandra as the mobile home he's owned for over 10 years went up in flames. I was outside stacking wood and Wally come out saying the smoke, the house was on fire. Then I got in there to the kitchen, the walls were already engulfed in flames. If any fire is hard to, you know, it's just to see somebody lose everything they have, it's, it's, it's tough. You know, it's just, you just don't want to be there. Mullen's second grade daughter also lives in the home, but was at school during the time of the fire. All my daughter, daughter's collectibles in there, collectible dolls and everything. All my daughter's clothes. I'm not worried about myself, just worried about my kid. I need a new house. In Masaki County, Charlie Lapastora for Up North Live News on ABC 29 and 8.